I'll try to run as fast as I can. As I said, I thought that Thank you guys, God bless you. We are born a worship team, Gulungulan Bosses. Now, Umutha Ucho offers him Konzai. Mudimur Rimudumilankum. And this God that we serve, Mudimo Ermusevan, He is a living God. Kimudimu Yapila. Asimudimu Yatu Swangabat. Aksu Yunkulunkulo Siswangabant. Empakimudi make it as Anseo Abatandesa Halep. Kotongunkulunkulu Ozenzela Loga Funa Wenze Gibantin Lai. Hallelujah. Amen. So today is the last day of our series. Today, kids at Lama Fellas Risia Runa. And if you 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 miss out from the past or you are not around. Hailu Huru Ulewa Misa out or no sitting. Renali, on, on those um, small group material. Go the small group material. We have email address. Who nali the email address? Hi, ba kina prochiteng. You'll get the email address yak. Hi, lo kuri kimo rute na re route lo kriya email address yah. And I saw a little bit on the Facebook. I get to allow me to comment on kapabo tapo. Since I am still here, on Tazange, I told him to buzz and buzz and not come. So if you allow it, it's like you take it for granted. I and that thing is for you to communicate. Oban ang ati ani tate lento ogoko to ibalulegi le inle la yoguti u u buzz. I want you to ask me question. I want you to comment. Moruti obata kuri obuti se di buzz kuri akono ku comment. I can be disturbed if inside the service you don't say. Amen. But I get disturbed if you are keeping quiet and also understand. Mara over disturb highly for our kulumi, our understand our boss. So today we do the last part of the series. Today, kiss Risia Mafello. And the Kadume la Harefe Samo. Nya Tembo, good master Alana. All the tools we've been teaching you, you'll be able to put into practice. So on the first day of the series, we dealt with planting season. And we said growing is not an option on the second week. There's no way you can be a Christian and you don't grow. You have to grow. And we, last week we spoke on pruning season. Last week we related to how to prune. And I wonder what is it that you have cut in Mubu Pilumba? Oh, I wonder how the king to ilo wa ikata Mubu Pilumba. For the pruning, it's a place where you need to shed things that are not in accordance with William Mudimu Kabu Pilumba. I wonder na kwa how to prune na kihuru u u u u u And this morning we speak on time of harvesters. Today, Bible is a harvest. Nako, ena kina ko ya ba kutu di. Le isi iskati sabanta ba vuna yo. Now, hara ba la bukenya di pesalima chapter one twenty six. Mas funda usam one twenty six. Rebala verse five to six. Ufunde o one to six. Eri ba le manka mi yoko bata kutu la kami huo ya tabo. Can you put up slides in English, please, there? Those who plant in tears will have a sweet shouts of joy. They weep as they go to plant their seed. But they sing as they return with the harvest. Those who plant in tears. Okay. 
will harvest with joy. But when they put the seed on the ground, they are not joyful. So they weep as they go to plant their seed. Because they don't have joy. So Muruti Veleme gave a very beautiful picture. He said he always watches his father as they plant the seeds. And he will be kneeling down and praying for the crown. He will be kneeling down and praying for the crown. May the rain come down so that we may have food in this. Now, there are strategies or principles in planting the seed or sowing it. And you follow those methods in order to be able to reach a certain goal. Anything that you start to do, you start it because you want to see a certain goal. And now these ones who are planting with tears, it's like they understood the past experiences that they had. And now, but they know ahead of time that they will Reap a good harvest. So if you want to understand the planting and the harvesting principle, read the way Mudima is and in Tokate. For each and every plant has got a, a capability of producing itself. Mudimu went say. All plants to be capable to reproduce after themselves. How about Genesis 111? Let the earth give forth. Let the earth bring forth the grass, all different types of plants. And same principle, it applies even to us. Each believer can be able to produce spiritually. Now you produce spiritually, but we see that tangible with our eyes. Hallelujah. And if you are Found in God's will. What you produce immediately shows who you are actually. Remember, I said somebody who comes from prison cannot go all over the world and say, Don't call me a bandit. No, it doesn't work. It's out of your conduct. Because now, if red or orange, it's not for you to tell us who to call you now. And in most cases, but let me Up until we are convinced of your conduct. Same with you, how you Now, if What determines who we call you is the fruits. So this is the time of harvesters. Now, beke fidlen ki se morana jeso ori buke nya John. Ifigel peli le ute o uche su ute nga ti nga John. Are already you are clean because of. Se ni lanze gile ngoba. 
because of what I've spoken in you. Not what is going to take place, but because of what I have spoken to you. That has made you whole. So it is not your problem how growth takes place. And you cannot decide or determine how it has to take place. Up until you allow pruning to take place. Now, you know the, 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 the old thing. Every time when Pinocchio lies, what happens? What happens? Every time when he lies, same with you. How The more you become a Christian, the more The more The more because every day we must every day how I'm sorry, I keep, I keep we interestingly live so excited. This is not about exciting. And that is why when you look at people, you don't want to be something. We are talking a serious stuff. We talk harvesting. More harvest. You take what is ready. Not only ready. But ready to be consumed. So how can you want to consume something that you didn't work for? Hey. You need to allow to be pruned. To end the right to harvest. I think we have the Bible Genesis to, 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 to revelation. Growth takes place out of willingness and obedience to God. I mentioned that God is a consuming fire last week. Can I go further and say something out of that? How many instances, uh, as you read the Bible and uh, what I'm going to say to you is very, very important. You must take it. Now, I'm saying, that is Character in the Bible. And you know the act of God on that character. In many instances, it's not unkulunkulu or shaya aban. Come on, you must hear this. But it is the presence of God that overcomes. Ananias le safira bana ne hore ke ditleva pela modimo. Ananias no safira ba ye ba qabang ukuthi bahlakana phile pham ngonkulunkulu. Ene ke ba fihla boteng ba modimo. Ba thema ba fike ebkhoneni ka ngonkulunkulu. Ke mo ba shwante. Ba se ba ya. Ba se modimo ba bla ile. A kusu ngonkulunkulu. Ke boteng ba modimo. Bona ba ka ngonkulunkulu. Hey. Ya ngizwa ne? Nya kuzo ba. Okay. Ha re bolawe as Bulawa Ibanta, Rebelawi Baruti, as Bulawa Bafundis, the Bulawa Koba with Timba Mudimu, Sibulawa Bukhona Gankulunko. Hey, now yo, ha, in that presence, oh Yamudim, a Bukoneni Lobo Gankulunko. It is not when we are not yet 
of the kingdom. That you get killed in his presence. You get killed in his presence. When you have proclaimed Hore, you take Christ as Lord and Savior of your life. Look, here I come and I come into this place and I don't say anything about nothing will happen to me. I don't say anything about you will never Get the benefits of harvest. the benefits of harvest. In in simple terms, ukatila e bunolo. Ukase ropi evangeli ya Jesus Christ. Ange gu ropi evangeli ya Jesus Christ. Because it's called me um shatola. Ribuleti kali nyalo mo. You know, there's this trend a corner. Either up with the normal sis, you will leave him to the Akim Sabini. I would say, Sibatlo Pila, Masafunu Shata, or Sunday, the Sun doing. Then how about Lonya Lauta Kerike? Because I would put the normal sis back on. Kaubane Bobo, I would deliver all Sibat and Abafund is about Kutazalin. Shat and Shat went over Sabari, Nyalang, Nyalang, Nyalang. Can't to Satan lose in this Oguta Shat. Then you want to harvest what, what is of God. Where's holiness and righteousness in that? You cannot harvest what is not yours. John 4:25. John 4, 25. Put up English, please. The woman said to him, I know that Messiah is coming. He who is called Christ. When he comes, he will tell us all things. By that time, just then his disciples yeah. come back. Marvel that he was talking with a woman. But no one said, what do you seek? Or why are you talking with him? So the woman left the water jar and went away into town and, and said to the people, Come see a man who told me all that I ever did. Hey, that portion is blessed by the Lord. Yeah, blessed. But give us a moment to write something today. Now, if I see another Christ, na. Agabe agi eno Christ na. So it is important to start to sow. So you may have this. Now, and we all agree for plantation to be made or to sow a seed, the ground needs to be prepared. And the growth takes place and now the pruning, all that before then the harvest comes. Christ Christ planted a seed on this woman. But I want us to look what is it that the disciples miss out of that. Or what we miss out of the harvest in that context. Now, given the past, for her, when she went back into the city and said, come and see what the, who, the man who told me everything. That has created more interest to those who are hearing her. 
nge pasti yake aibe ba muzwa kwenze kuti oh. balanga ba zelela kakhulu so there was so much interest in what she's saying beba funukuzwa ngalokho akushoyo and i believe the more interest was not on women but it was more on men the past year high with men. So, more men pay attention to what this woman is talking about. And she didn't fully understand or just so much. Impa, what she knows best was the man that she's going to. Kodwa ebekakwazi kahle yile ndoda ebekaya kuyo. Umene ndoda le anga ikhosho ukuthi uChrist. Uye Emily muna o. She agrees that it could be Jesus. Uwa suggest akho ukuthi kabathi Christ. But she's not sure ukuthi uyu Messiah na. Mara nasi sho gore ke yena Messiah na. And she went to the city and tell everybody as you know. That on its own was a moment of a harvest. Christ talking to her was a moment of planting the seed. But for her running back to the seed was a moment of a harvest. Now here's the sad thing again I miss in terms of harvest. The disciples are hungry. They go into the same city where this woman comes from. And when you study the time frame there, now, Musado of it, I but of it I get the disciples of Christ who are about to go into a city that they know Haina Christ. So, Bafitile this woman Oh. Hallelujah. Amen. So you plant and you, you wait again. So you may be able to harvest. We agree, that's a principle. You plant, th then you wait, then you harvest. But guess what? In God's kingdom, it doesn't work like that. In God's kingdom, we don't plant and wait for harvest to take place. But in God's kingdom, after we have planted, we work towards going to get the harvest. No, 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 no. We go and harvest. Hey. Hallelujah. So we don't wait. For when we wait, birds will come and take the seed. When harvest time comes, everything needs to be put aside. Nothing matters during time of harvest. Why? Why, why nothing matters? It is because when, when the pinch is ready, and, and, and you waste time of harvesting, what happens to the when you waste time to harvest, what was said before you to take, you will find it stinking. You'll find it rotten because you didn't pick it at its right time. So there's no way you will wait for harvest to come. But you go to the plantation and get the harvest. But if you don't get it, there will be just a smell in the place. Now, this poor woman who's come from this city, she saw something that disciples couldn't see. Now, 
Yena tsa me ila lola tabanne. Yena o hambile wa yo thatha abo baba. Nahan. Hey. They went to buy bread this she went to fetch me. Bona ba hambile ba yo thengi sing kwa yena o hambile wa yo landa ma abo baba. Their appetite clouded them they couldn't see. I appetite ya bo iba valila zang ba kono bona. Sometimes we come to the house of God because of the appetite. But not appetite to be convicted by Holy Spirit. But to see what is happening in this house today. Then you miss the harvest. Oh Lord, give us sight to see what you want us to see. Can you give us what matters most, Mapilonga? They didn't want to do anything with this depressed woman, this guy. This broken, the outcast. Fevesses, who do just to that is why Baya Batisa brought over Satisibat. Yinga Kobe Baleti Zing Kwabanga Litaban. Bawes, because by then already they have been even ordained in their office. Moban Shalo Beseba Otenu. And Officer Bona Egil Mutaba Ying Baswasiba. E Officer Bobe Gutua Bazo Bangaba do Bibe in Tan. Baband. Baband. And now their hunger began to grow more and more as about, about to close. Lambe la wabo wa gwa kula ga kula. Jala yabon. In jala yabo. Begin to grow more. Ya kula ya kula. Why? Because they focus on on it. As they walk, they miss to be alert and see what's happening. And they focus on their stomach. They focus here. And what you focus on, you grow it. We are coolies. Hey. Where's that peak of mine? Let's look at this. Okay. When you look at this, it's so motivating. This guy is taking this thing up. But is it really necessary? Because he's focusing on pushing this thing to the team. In fact, he shouldn't have done that. Where he is right now, he's in danger. So, it grows up until it finishes you. Because one mistake that rock will be on top of him. But there's a way to sort out this mess. So <laughs> Ah, come on. <laughs> Why you take nonsense and put it here? 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 Why when a moment of harvest comes, we behave like an ap. Behave like an ap. 
It's four. Forget it got something. So, But it's a man. Hamba. Hamba because So they brought that bread, not people. I pray when you go out of this place. Know what you want. Maybe the first question that you need to answer. Why would you? Why 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 would you do this? There are so many places you can go. Next to us here, yes, the show. We can hear things. La gune show la ituzan. Why why would you do this today? Why when I would do this? Do you understand or why would you? What's the bar for the kaba kale lifting would you do? But I don't want to leave you with guilt. Maybe if you feel guilt. Aga funu kunchi ya ni 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 guilt. But I want to when you go out there, go out with a new look and a new understanding. Ufuna kutuma puma la upume uno konda ogusha. For as the heavens are higher than the earth. So our ways are higher than your ways. And my thoughts than your thoughts. Mm. For as the rain and the snow come down from heaven. And do not return back without watering the earth. But making it bring forth and sprout the, 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 the seed. Why? So that the sower and the bread he gives it to the eater. He gives the seed and the bread to the sower. So shall my word be that goes up. It shall not return to my to me empty. But it shall accomplish that which I propose. And shall succeed in the thing for which I sent it. That is Isaiah 59. But I want you to remember this. What I quoted in Psalm 126, verse They weep as they go to plant their seed. But they sing as they return with the harvest. For time of harvesters. Why are you here? How many years have you been here? Kimi wa khami kai ulimo. King ewe bone mudi maet. Ubone nungulungula kwa nza yo. Kimo sholo fing o mudi maet zilizewa. Easy pi manga li sos boni nungulungula kwa nza lezo. If you haven't had an abnormal encounter the mudi. Uma unga zangu sanga ni na nungulungul. There must be something abnormal like a milita halu moe. Well, for when it is normal, then something is not yet there. Familiar spirit is a deceiver and it takes away what God wants to do. Spirit is trying to make it so that it is not there. We don't want that in your life. But you need transformation of your life. Tinga it transformation yempilo yako. 
I don't know if you have ever been in hospital when a person is about to die and needs a pastor to come a, and pray. A, 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 you love that moment. moment ye, utlo, and in fact, it's not supposed to be like that. And it must supposed to start while you are here. To be desperate for God, it's not when things are not working in your life. But being desperate, it is when you seek this joy that you once experienced, it's gone, and you are satisfied with that. You must not, you must not. There's something that it has to take you back more mudimana na lo wena te guna le nte fanele unkulunkula kubisele muva la unkulunkule bika nawe khona ka ntle ho tumela hona ka more ka thabisa mudimo ka phandle go kholwa ayikho indlela singajabulisa ngayo unkulunkula without faith we cannot please phandle go kholwa ngeke simjabulisa unkulunkula imagine amotho batla mothabisa cabanga umuntu ufuna ukumjabulisa then the word says without faith you cannot please god Shining light, I can assure you, if there's something that I desire, Shining light and that is the cry in my heart, that we lack to have, is to have faith in God. We can sing, we can pray, we can give, but we are far from having faith with this God. God. Have faith with God, please. And that is why it's so easy when people come and deceive you about mm, there's God, but there's another way to see heaven. And you doubt because you don't have faith. But we need to have faith in God. So that He may change our lives. Shall we stand on our feet? You need to have faith in God. Faith in God. Just bow your heads. Look inside of you. And ask yourself this question. What is it that I am harvesting? What is it that I'm going to harvest this week? This week. Do I have faith of what you show me, Lord? Because here I can assure you, He shows you. What is it to harvest? Do I have faith for it? Your prayer this morning, this afternoon. Lord, help me to see what is worthy before you. What you. to begin pray silently. Listen, Holy Spirit, to help you to pray. Because just making statement it doesn't help us. But to seek the voice of the voice of your heart. Please seek, seek in your heart, seek, seek in your heart. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus.